Hi guys, welcome back. This is going to be messages from Spirit for the Collective. All right, so let's see what messages Spirit has for the Collective at this time. All right, sorry about that. So this is for um, anyone and everyone. Take what messages resonate and leave the rest, okay? So what's the messages Spirit got in this universe for the Collective? What's the messages? For the collective at this time, summoning rising Venus and all signs. Whatever your sign may be, this is collective read for everyone. This is a general reading, so take what resonates and lead the rest. Okay, so wow, that is an omen because the deck I had it in reverse, but this five of swords flipped out in the upright. So somebody here is very, very, very jealous, very hateful. This could be how somebody is looking at you, or this is how you're looking at someone. Okay. Very hateful, very nasty. I feel like somebody wants revenge. This is a, could be somebody who, yeah, the strength card. One second. Sorry, guys. Okay. Yeah, somebody has a strong hate for you with the strength card. Somebody really, really, really does hate your fucking guts. Let me see what I can get off this card here. Okay. Make sure you're wearing your evil eye protection at all times. Okay, y'all? Because somebody here is vengeful, they hateful. Let me see if I could pick up something on this card. This person's thoughts. I rebuke this in the name of Jesus, but I do feel like some something about a glove. So someone's going to try to wear gloves. They may try to attack you. This is not for everybody. This could have happened or already happened. There could be some kind of stabbing or something that's taking place here. Or something, all right? I just give the messages, all right? But um, yeah, I feel like, so that was just for somebody here, okay? But I feel like somebody just hates everything you do. This is something new that you're doing. This could be something where you, where you do, um, like hand art, face art, or something like that. Somebody's jealous that you're doing that or I'm just, I'm just getting like somebody, it's, it's almost as if somebody hates you. They don't even have a valid reason why they do. I think it's just because of who you are, how you move, who you are as a person overall. I, I just feel like somebody's truly, truly, truly jealous of that. This could even be your strength because the strength card came out in the, uh, pre, the reading I did right before this. So go check it out. Okay. What is the five of swords? So this is competition, competition, jealousy, envy. What is the five of swords? What is the five of swords? I feel like somebody hates what you're wearing or how beautiful you are or something is, or, or a, um, A certain amount of knowledge that you have, I knew it. The high priestess, okay. There's some somebody hates that you know. Yes, the king of swords, I knew it. I this this person they hate the knowledge that you have, respect you're intuitive, that you're skilled at what you do, that you know something here. That's crazy how I call that. Yeah, the four of pentacles and the tower in the reverse with the magician. So, like I said, some type of knowledge. That you possess something that you know that they don't know. Somebody knows that you will always win. 
to a certain de degree because of the knowledge that you possess because of what you know it's almost as if like something still stands it's almost as if somebody wished that your tower would fall or that that you didn't have this this knowledge it, it could be a scorpio or a pisces here with the tower card in the reverse something something i'm also getting somebody has a, a the, the knowledge about something here that they're keeping very much a secret I'm getting something about, um, I'm hearing something about the woods or a body. Yeah, we have the magician, the world, and the lovers, and the nine of swords. So a cycle is over here, okay? Somebody sees you as a match, master or coach. With the king of swords, you are the best at what you do. You are a genius. You're a beast at reading tarot or tapping into the, the unknown. You guys really need to go watch the reading I did previous to this. Five, five, five on the clock. You have deep knowledge of this Akashic record. You're very powerful. Somebody could be jealous of the knowledge that you hold, but you seem to be holding on to this. You're not revealing this information or it is, it, you keep this very secret to you. Of course, the high priestess doesn't expose everything. I feel like you're able to conjure up. I, I feel like you're somebody here so powerful that they can they can cause change in the weather. They can cause cause storms, lightning, rain, or whatever. This could be an Aries as well, an Aries, a Scorpio, or a Pisces. So somebody's hiding their jealousy, their envy of your body of knowledge, what you know, and what you're holding on to. I'm also getting somebody's mad because of somebody wanted your empire to fall but it still stands something is very stable here for you so if somebody's coming for your empire something that you built or whatever this is it's not going to work you're too skilled king of swords you're too intelligent and you're too aware and you have the type of knowledge that people most people in life will never possess you are an occultist magician and, and the high priestess and you're very skilled at it and you know a lot with the king of swords you have mastered this particular subject. And I'm getting you continue to master it. Somebody wants you to re really reveal something. But something's not going to be revealed. Tower in reverse is literally something something being hidden. In the upright, the lightning is striking and bringing the tower down. But in the reverse, the tower remains. Okay, the four of pentacles, the secrets, the high priestess is the secret. So you're really holding on to this body, body of knowledge. Somebody wants you to teach it or say it or express it or tell them something and you will not. They're mad because you have this knowledge and they don't. Just as simple as that. Yeah, you can affect change with the magician and the world card. Yeah, you have you the world card falling out that like that. Okay. A cycle is over. It's complete. You have you have you have acquired a certain level of knowledge with around something here. Somebody knows they can't fuck with you with that shit. Yeah, the magician in the world. You you definitely can change. You you you're you're a master of culture shit. Somebody here is a very powerful and they can affect change in the world the weather and everything you could be dealing with an aquarius or you could be dealing with a pisces or you could be dealing with an aries or somebody with that highly aspected okay could be a scorpio here because scorpio is here as well all right so what else is this fight yes yeah, so somebody's mad who is this five of swords who is this five of swords Okay, yeah, the four of wands. This could be somebody you live with. You even live in a home with. Seven of swords. Very sneaky. There's somebody that you can't trust here. Be, be, be very careful. This could be even somebody you live with here. Or, or, and if not, this could be somebody that you're in a relationship with. You live with, you're in a relationship with. Or this could be somebody that... Um, is jealous of your home or jealous of this or this could be somebody that wants a relationship with you okay yeah the seven of swords the eight of cups and the justice could be dealing with the libra but i'm getting karma is here something somebody is being very sneaky here 
the seven of swords, five of swords, somebody could be hiding their secret. Somebody could be hiding something here. I will be very careful here dealing with someone. All right. What is the four of wands? What is the four of wands? This could also be that you're, somebody could be jealous of the fact that you're on stage or very attractive or that. What is the four of wands? Okay, I'll be very careful here with what you're um, dealing with here. Yeah, the Page of Pentacles. So with the Page of Pentacles and the Strength, this could be somebody... That's younger than you. You have the Eight of Swords and the Five of Pentacles. With the Eight of Wands and the Devil. What is this page of Pentacles? So there's something new that you do. Some of you are definitely could be uh, tarot readers here. Most definitely. Okay. And the Ace of Cups. All right. So something is complete here. This could also be travel uh, for some of you. Yeah, the Ace of Cups and the Eight of Wands, okay? With the Six of Swords here, I feel like you, you've you moved ahead or you made a decision to move ahead. I feel like somebody is like wanting, somebody is really yearning for you, wanting a relationship with you. Somebody's mad because you know this or because of your power or your position. Somebody wants you to come back, okay? Or somebody, yeah, the Ace of Cups, but you have new love here or new love is coming in fast. You may be relocating or traveling to see someone or meeting someone new while traveling. Yeah, the Three of Swords. And the Three of Cups with the Palace of Swords. Yeah, you found out about a third party or, or something that took place at a distance. Or something like that. What is the um, Six of Swords? Yeah, the Three of Wands. It's like somebody can't, um, yeah, in the Eight of Pentacles. So this is, yeah, someone's really pining after you, really wanted to come towards you, make a move towards you. Somebody wants to come back. Somebody, it, they just keep looking back to you. They can't seem to let you go. But this is somebody that could be very jealous of you as well. But they can't move on from you either. This is somebody that wants to work with you here. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles, Three of Wands. Some of you could be relocating for work. But you, you're looking towards the future here. You're no longer looking. This person can't move on from you, but I'm getting you've moved on from this person. Yeah, the Knight of Wands. There's something definitely about travel here. All right, but this person is definitely like waiting or wanting to come in and communicate with you. Somebody wants to have honest communication here with you. I feel like somebody feels defeated. They know that you hold a certain body of knowledge or that you hold a certain position here. Your empire is not going to fall. You're going to, your future is bright. Somebody knows this. You're going to have what it is that you want. You could be world renowned with the four of wands in the world card. You're, or, or, or you're traveling across the world or overseas, but you're doing something here. You're making, you're, you're um, moving ahead. But this person, they know that. All right. Yeah. All right. We have the uh, Emperor, okay, and Aries, a double Aries. Aries could be significant here, an Aries or a Pisces or a Scorpio. Or somebody with this highly aspected. But we have the Emperor, the, the Magician, and the Faith card. 
So somebody knows that you that you look towards the future. Somebody knows you have the Eight of Pentacles and the Magician, the High Priestess. You put in work. You you can have your own business here with the Emperor. You could be somebody who prays that's very faithful, very enlightened, very spiritual. You could be very spiritual as well as very religious as well. You could be very much into God as well as very spiritual. You could be somebody that it doesn't have really, you know. Any belief system. Yeah, we have the Empress. So the Emperor and the Empress with the faith and the magician. Yeah, I'm going to use prayer that you manifested this, this here. Your life, your work. I, I just feel like somebody sitting somewhere just obsessed with... What's the, what is the Emperor? Obsessed with what you have going on or something like that. You have the Six of Wands. Success and recognition. You're running your own business. You're doing very well for yourself. Yeah, the judgment, okay? So, so there's something, yeah... The Hermit, the Queen of Swords. Yeah, very intelligent here. Okay, the Palace of Cups, the Three of Pentacles, the Ten of Swords. So, vic victory, success, and recognition. You're doing what you're called to do. I feel like somebody's trying to conjure up the dead as well. Doing some kind of seance or ritual. or, or, or I see somebody with a Ouija board or whatever this is. But if you're doing this, I'm getting you're going to be able to succeed. So, something's going to be a success here with the Six of Wands. Okay, but that's not my business. But I see you, you, you really, you've really prayed or you really put in the work towards your future with that Eight of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. Okay, yeah, I'm getting faith. Something is your destiny here with this judgment and this will of fortune. Okay. Yes, yeah, so the page with sun card. Yes, success, recognition. Somebody here is very muscular, very masculine, very attractive, very fit, very, very sexy. This could be a male with long hair. I'm getting something about someone's arms. Their arms are very sexy, their chest, their abs. Okay, if this is a male, if this is a woman, she's very fit, beautiful body here, curves, the perfect breasts, arms, legs, stomach, butt, hips, everything. So this could be male or female, but you're successful. You're running your business. You're putting in work, eight of pentacles, tower in the reverse. This is what, yeah, you seem to have a lot of resources. You're shining here. What is this? Um, yeah, the nine of pentacles. Absolutely. Nine of pentacles can be a model. So single, self-made, you're really running. You're really doing your thing here. Okay, somebody's hiding the fact that they're jealous of that king of pentacles. Your money is coming in. You're doing well. You're independent, self-sufficient. You're strong, very attractive, very hard to reach as well. Very, very powerful. I'm just getting like um, a sorcerer. Someone's very powerful here. And I'm getting you have all the tools that it takes. You could even be, yeah, somebody's a warlock. I'm hearing a warlock or something like that. But you're a beast. Yeah, here's this empress again. I'm also getting somebody's going to have a baby here. Something about a child, a baby, a very special child that is being born here. I'm getting a spirit baby that is going to be born here. We have the emperor and the empress. So this could be a twin flame or divine counterpart connection. This could even be in a marriage. Some of you are going from being single to uh, um, a single mother with the nine of pentacles and the page of pentacles to being in a full committed marriage, a very happy one with the sun card. I'm getting this emperor is in love with you. They feel very happy and victorious. Somebody holds you on a very high pedestal here as well. There's somebody somewhere mad. Okay, what's the, give me more on this, um. Five of Swords, yeah, the Ten of Swords. Somebody feels really defeated. They feel really weighed down and beaten down. I feel like somebody did everything to defame you, to, to fuck up your character and everything, and they were not able to. Yeah, now we have the Nine of Wands with the Five of Swords. Somebody hates you. It's like somebody wants to see you down, broken down. Somebody hates your confidence, Six of Wands. It's, it's, it's almost like somebody wants to defeat you, but it's not going to work or it didn't work. 
What's the nine of wands? I just feel like somebody's sitting back watching your fucking life, but this is you. Watching you have what you want. What's the five, what's the um what is the ten of swords, the nine of wands, and the five of swords? Somebody feels defeated because they couldn't beat you down or you or they couldn't, yeah, the moon card. Somebody's very yeah, it could be a cancer. Somebody holds a lot of secrets or something about somebody's eyes. All right. I'm going to need to take a closer look at somebody's eyes. All right. Somebody could be doing some, trying to do some kind of magic here. I feel like, I also feel like somebody's eyes, this could be a Cancerian or somebody with cancer, highly aspected. They can go from looking very, very evil. Very, very evil to looking very loving and sad. You feel what I'm saying? Somebody here has two sides to them. Somebody here could be very, very loving, okay? Very um, sweet and all that, but they can also be very hateful, nasty, jealous, and vindictive, and they hold a lot of secrets here. Somebody could be into some very dark shit here, okay? You need to be careful with who you live with or who you have around you. But I'm getting you're aware with the high priestess. But with the high priestess and the four of pentacles, you don't. The high priestess knows when to act and what to say. The high priestess plays her hand very well. You can never outsmart her or him or whoever. I'm getting with the high priestess being here. You are aware that somebody is jealous or that they have two sides. You're aware. You have been new about this. But you know how to play your cards. Okay. Because we did see justice. We did see the justice. So karma is here and judgment. So whatever somebody's doing to or, or thinking they're getting away with doing to this divine being, they are not. And they will pay. Just because people don't say shit don't mean they don't know what's up. Never think you're outsmarting. Look at that. As I said, justice. There she go. Never think you're outsmarting a high priest. Like, that's the stupidest thing you could do. All right. But I feel like somebody's sitting up. They really hate you. Somebody could be jealous of your home or jealous of, of your life or what you have, your independence that you have. That You, you could have a very well-dressed son, a very attractive child or something like that. Okay. Yeah, the three of cups. All right. You have the Queen of Pentacles and the Nine of Swords. So you're successful. You're doing well. Very well dressed. I'm getting something about your cleavage. Somebody could very much like that. Something that you wear on your head. This could be some kind of headband. Something about some earrings or something. Okay. Or the color green. Somebody could be wearing the color green from head to toe. It looks good. You look beautiful or something like that. Or somebody looks like money. That's what I'm hearing. Somebody looks like money. Period. I feel like somebody's mad about that. Or they feel way down. It's almost like somebody wants you to feel. Somebody's like competing with you. Or somebody wants you to feel a certain way. Or somebody wants you to. I don't know what somebody wants you to do. But it's not going to be. What is, what is this? Now somebody shook. What's the nine of swords? At what you know or that you know this or that you called it out. I, that's what I'm getting. Like, you just called this out. Now somebody shook. They're scared. Somebody here is very secretive with these moon cards. That This moon that keeps showing up in the cards. Somebody, it's a cancer. Or it could be any damn body. But I'm getting, you're aware. And they're shook. They know you know what's up. Or now you will know what's up if you didn't. Okay, yeah, you're well aware. King of so Queen of Swords could be a Libra. Somebody knows how intelligent you are. Somebody knows somebody like, damn, this bitch is intuitive and intelligent. This bitch knows what, what the fuck is going on or something's been discovered or you just know somebody's annoyed or they're insecure about that. Somebody's very insecure at the knowledge that you hold, at what you know, at, at your power, at who you are. Yeah, the strength card. And you don't mind speaking your truth. You will unleash it. You don't give a fuck. You, I'm getting somebody here that says what they mean. And they say it with conviction. With this queen of swords. Straightforward. Straight out. 
and it is what it is. I'm getting somebody may even look like this when they speak. Very intimidating energy here. I feel like somebody's intimidated by you. They hate you, but they're intimidated by you. Or somebody could just be feeling in, like defeated. But I feel like somebody wants to be a part of your team or they want to be with you or something like that. This could even be a twin flame. This could even be your own damn twin flame hate and, act and, and shit like this. So it's different for it's different for everybody, okay? But I'm definitely getting an energy of this. Yeah, I'm getting with the hermit. You're definitely aware, very in tune with yourself. I'm getting somebody here that meditates as well. I feel like this person sent a lot of a, a lot of spell work or did a lot of spell work on you behind the scenes. You're aware of it. You know exactly what they were doing, what they're doing, what they tried to do. You're not going to say anything. You know exactly when to unleash the dragon on this person or these people. Okay. Somebody, every, all these dark forces or whatever shit people were doing behind the scenes it has been exposed you know exactly what's going on high priestess queen of swords king of swords we have the emperor and the empress as well so you could be in a divine counterpart connection and this could be somebody that you that was also a um soulmate of some sort here from the past is this person what's the nine of swords who's this nine of swords ten of swords five of swords energy with this moon I feel like somebody is mentally disturbed here as well. Somebody has a mental condition. Yeah, the justice could be a Libra, but I feel like karma. I feel like somebody is worried about karma. A word, somebody could be a double Libra, Libra rising and a Libra sun with the Empress on top of the sun card and a and this uh, justice with the Queen of Swords, Libra rising and Libra sun, okay? But somebody knows karma is here. They know what they're facing. They know who you are. And they know how you can bring it down. Okay? Somebody, you see, again, there's something about the weather. You could change the weather here. You see how this Libra is holding these scales? And that in those storms is in the background. That those dark skies. Somebody here can affect the weather. Somebody here can bring it the fuck down. Somebody can affect everybody's world with the world card here. Somebody can make change like that. Some here with the magician and the motherfucking um, hermit. Somebody's a hermetic. Somebody's a master occult. Somebody here is in their bloodline. It's who they are. Somebody's mad about that or something. What's the justice? Somebody, somebody here. So yeah, the knight, the the chariot. Yeah, I'm definitely getting a cancer. Somebody with cancer, highly aspected. Okay, or an Aries or a Libra or a Pisces, a Leo possibly as well, Scorpio. But we have heavy Aries and heavy Cancer. Okay, yeah, the Five of Cups, somebody lost. Okay. Somebody lost out. Yeah, the Eight of Wands. Somebody wants to come back in. This is somebody who's regretful. They want to come back in. They want to reach out. They're going to email you, text you. Yeah, the fool. Somebody wants to clean slate. They want to start over. But you're already aware. Yeah, the Five of Wands and the Ace of Cups. I'm giving you have new love, but somebody's coming in wanting to fight for you. They want to fight for you. They want to be with you or something. I'm giving you already know who this person is they also see you doing very well here you already know that this person is not what you're looking for you know that this person is hateful yeah the six of pentacles i see a lot of you being patronized a lot of um emails a lot of reaching out for your services here people want to pay you for your services for your work whatever this is you do here yeah the death card okay scorpio yeah there's that moon card i feel like somebody's hiding the fact that they're sick here i'm also seeing somebody being out in the woods someone's gonna get bit by a snake or they got bit by a snake a venomous one somebody may die as a result of this i just give the messages okay but i see somebody here they're, they're, they're sick. They're, they're dwindling. Okay. If they try to send any negative shit towards you, justice is here. Somebody's going to pay 
for that shit or they're paying for it. Yeah, they are. Okay. I feel like um Yeah, the Tower in reverse, five of pentacles in the reverse, but the palace of pentacles, you're not going to be in poverty, just period. The universe is always going to conspire to give you what you want. Empress card, sun card, being successful and recognize recognition here. This feels like some star energy. There it is. I knew it. So I feel like somebody could be in the public eye, a star or some shit, a healer. You have the nine of cups, double, double wishes, getting what you want, being happy. Okay. A lot of you could be coming out of poverty. There could be some money coming in here for you. Okay. Yeah, the Knight of Pentacles. And the Five of Wands. With the Ace of Cups and the Seven of Swords. I also feel like if you met somebody new, that somebody could be trying to cause uh, problems in your relationship. So be aware of that. Okay. For some of you who are business owners, if things were a little slow, because I see you doing very well financially, you're still stable. You're not in the five of pentacles, but the five of pentacles in reverse. The queen of pentacles is here. The empress is six of pentacles. If it was steady or, or, or not much movement, I'm getting that's going to be picking back up. Yeah, nine of cups. You're That's making it. That's all your wishes being granted. You're going to have what it is you want. The universe conspires. This is also love with the emperor and the empress. The emperor and the empress is here. Like, yeah, we have the temperance, the perfect blending of energy. Sagittarius energy here. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting a very, a very deep connection. A very, um, I'm getting a pregnancy here. Someone's going to get pregnant. Okay. Or somebody's body is getting ready, ready for pregnancy or something like that. If you've been trying to get pregnant, I'm getting you're going to get good news about that. You're going to be very happy. It's going to be a boy. Okay. But I'm getting like a very comfortable relationship, a very peaceful one. The perfect blending of energies with the temperance, the emperor and the empress here. When I clarified it, I feel like you're happy. You're living, you're, you're, you're doing your thing here. Why is the six of wands and three of cups here? Okay. Yeah. The death and the palace of cups. So there's something that's changing or your, your, or your feelings have changed. Your emotions has changed regarding a situation here. Yeah, the two of wands. You are definitely chosen for this life, for this destiny to, to live this way. I see you making really good choices regarding your life. Okay. Yeah, the five of wands. What is the five of wands? So there could be a lot of conflict here about a decision that you're making. Yeah, the Ten of Pentacles. Okay, the Palace of Pentacles. So there could be a lot of people jealous. This could even be in your family with the Ten of Pentacles or, or, or competing with you. Your family is trying to compete with you here. What is the Five of Wands, Ten of Pentacles? Or, the, or gossiping or something like that. Or this could be several people in your family fighting about money or stuck or something. What is the Eight of Swords, Ten of Pentacles? I don't know. I don't know what this. I, I don't know what this is. Why these cards flip out in the reverse? So I, yeah, I'm getting the uh, Palace of Pentacles in the reverse. So if this is a marriage, this could be loss of finances, money, or breakup. But I'm, I'm getting there could be several people in your family. I'm getting like justice here. Something is backfired. People are losing their homes or their marriages or. There seems to be a lot of conflict, arguing, and fighting here. There's a lot of grief and heartbreak, a lot of drinking and manipulation and lies going on here. I feel like this is with the world and the with the justice. I feel like this is like the tables have turned here on a lot of people, a family, or whatever this is. Yeah, the Page of Wands in the Palace of Wands. You're going to get confirmation of something here. Yeah, the Palace of Swords. Okay, the Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, and the Ace of Wands. God damn. So I feel like there's several people attracted to you, watching you, wanting to apologize to you. This could be in your family. 
They're seeing you get all these opportunities. Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, Ace of Wands. I feel like now, all of a sudden, when you don't give a fuck about the, about the praise or the recognition or any of that shit from these people, from the support, these people never supported you. Now, all of a sudden, they want to come in and apologize or give you the, yeah, the Knight of Cups. When I said that, give you these offers, apologize, give you praise and recognition and, and hold you up on this pedestal. But I'm getting you, you're, you're like, no, Seven of Wands. Where was all that shit at? I'm getting your confidence standing in your own skin doing you. Let's get a couple of these cards here for the collective. These people have done a lot of shit. Justice is here, though. What's the messages for the collective, please? Now people shook Nine of Swords justice. I clarify the Nine of Swords is the justice about this karmic that's coming in. Because it's coming in fast. It seems to be a whole lot. If someone's worried about what, you know, somebody could have been fake the whole time in your face, family, friends, a relationship, or now they're worried about that they know you know that they, they're secretly jealous or whatever the fuck they're doing. Somebody cannot outsmart you, man. Somebody is really, 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 they know how powerful you are. And I'm, give, I'm getting you keep all of the most important things to yourself. High Priestess, Four of Pentacles. You will never tell a fucking soul. The tower in reverse, you will bring it down on motherfuckers. Somebody knows that or these people know that. Let's clarify this energy that's here. Let's clarify this energy that's here, please. For the collective, what is this energy that is here for the collective? I'm getting you moved on with your life. You're in a happy relationship with your twin flame or counterpart. You could be getting married here or whatever. Okay? But all those aces that are showing up like that, like it's like a lot of people wanting to come in and offer you things now or, or, or something like that. Okay? It says, love me or leave me alone. Yeah, and you and you want these people to leave you the fuck alone, okay? It says, a contract, okay? And that one to come out in reverse, I'm going to take that as an omen, okay? You're not going to, yeah, there's no contract or you're not going to go into contract with these people or, or you're not going to something, okay? Hold on. I'm also getting you won't be moving a contract forward. You will not be working with this person or something is not going to move forward here. Okay. Let me try to straighten out all these cards a little bit. I'll take the ones that came out in reverse as an omen, but I hate when my cards are not together but yeah um also it's flipped over here okay so forward movement all right okay spirit's telling me not to take these in reverse all right so we have um love me or leave me alone for it moving yeah you move past these people they they could not love you or they did not support you or they did or they were hateful or nasty or doing spell work or whatever the fuck they had going on all that shit backfired with the justice it says a contract in your love is like a drug so this could be um you could be going to a connection here a marriage or something with somebody that you're very much in love with and that's very much in love with you as well okay is what I'm getting. Okay. Yeah, we have that wop got him whipped. So this is somebody that finds your vagina to be really, really good here. Okay. Okay, or really wet. Pay attention to the red flags, okay? So like I said, pay attention to the red flags. This could be somebody you're in a relationship with for some of you. All right. What else? Okay. We have, I have secrets I don't know how to explain, okay? I'm also getting, um, yeah, so you have secrets here. You, you hold knowledge here, okay? All right, and they know that. I'm also getting, yeah, um, yeah, digmatized. So this person is so with that coming out in the reverse digmatized, it could be that you this person is very whipped by your vagina, but you're not by their little ass penis. OK, so let's see. We have I'm trying to rob you of all your opportunities that wanted to come out in the reverse. 
Somebody also wants you to know that they're being honest and truthful with you. They're not lying to you. They want the best for you or something like that. This could be somebody that you're dating here. Okay. All right. It says living lavishly. Yeah, you could be living lavishly. Okay. Yeah, baby on board. I see this empress holding a baby. I see somebody pregnant possibly or someone's going to give birth, but there's a baby here or someone wants to have a baby with you. Okay, we have big dick energy. Okay, go read, go watch that reading I just posted. Okay, and I think of what um, our kids would look like. So somebody definitely wants kids with you. This could be somebody very prideful in a very high position with the six of wands. Okay, we have karmic stalking. Yeah, and and please wait for me while I tie up loose ends. So there's a karmic somewhere stalking and watching you. This could be the same person that was doing this. Yeah, cut ties that you cut ties with. Somebody's hoping you wait for them and that they have a second chance with you. It's not going to happen. Okay, you've cut ties or you're cutting ties. Just period. Yeah, psycho because somebody's psycho. They're crazy as fuck. It's a setup. Somebody could have been trying to set you up to get you locked up or fucked up as well. Heartbroken and betrayed. This is somebody who's heartbroken who betray you. Ten of swords right here. Okay, who's a liar, who's done everything they could to set you up, to hinder you, to block you, to stop you, and do everything. And it did not work. Okay, obviously with the cars that are here. Obsessively watching you, yeah. Obsessively watching you and the karmic stalking. So somebody stalks your ass. Page of Swords, Palace of Swords is there. All day, or several people do. Okay, yeah, it says in... In the public eye. So somebody here is in the public eye star. I figured that. Okay. The sexual attraction is strong. Someone's very, very attractive with this palace of wands. Several people are attracted to you. And spiritual bath. This could be a spiritualist with the high priestess. Somebody that is a, spirit, a spiritualist. Some of you need to take a spiritual bath. It's safe to trust them. So, yeah, that goes back to what I was saying. There's somebody here that you can trust. They're not going to lie to you, hurt you, or anything. Okay, this could be this person you're with now or that you're or you're about to meet. But um, somebody here, you know, okay, we have they are being haunted. Yeah, that's that nine of swords. Somebody or these people are being haunted by how they treated you and what and what they've done. Okay, it says a storm is brewing. Again, something about storms. Somebody can conjure up storms. Somebody can cause the weather storms and everything to change. Yeah, player cheater and a whole Mike Jones effect. See, so somebody back then, somebody was a cheater, a liar, and a hoe. Back then, they didn't want your ass. Now you hot and they all know you. You feel me? Secretly hates you. Yes, I already said that. Somebody you could be dealing with could secretly hate your ass or hate what you know. Okay? So I hope this helped you. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share. Follow your girl, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.